you reckon Motherwell have got what it takes? Well, if, if they play well and Rangers don't play well, of course they have a chance. OK, thanks for now, Derek. Well, there was another third-round replay, of course, in the Tenant Scottish Cup tonight. It was a rugby park, and it certainly produced some drama. It was Kilmarnock against Middlebank. We join it midway through the first half. Kilmarnock struggling to cling on to their promotion hopes in the league, looking for a cup run as well. And this is what happened with 27 minutes gone. Watch for Ian Little on the end of this in the box. The looping header beats Bobby Geddes and that's Meadowbank one up. 18 year old Ian Little but he was scoring goals when he was 16 so he hasn't lost the habit. 15 minutes from time, Kilmarnock really fighting for their cup lives at this stage. And there's Hugh Burns, the former Rangers player with the chest control, just checking he wasn't offside, a quick glance at the far side linesman. Penalty shootout now after no goals in extra time, and that was Dave Roseborough with penalty number one. Meadowbank one up in the penalty shootout. Now Tom Black, former Airdrian St. Lauren player. Well, he scored a cracker on Saturday, and that was 1-1 on penalties. Bobby Geddes on the Kilmarnock on goal line. And it's Armstrong with Meadowbank second. In off the inside of the post. But that's 2-1 to the Edinburgh team. Roberts with the second for Kilmarnock. Soft one, saved by McQueen. And that was 2-1 Meadowbank at that stage. Urban missed as well though, Bobby Geddes saved and the scoreline stayed 2-1. That was Hugh Burns, he scored in normal time and that was his penalty which made it 2 each. Ian Little, that's his second, 3-2. Callum Campbell, 3 all. He's getting tense now. Stuart Williamson for Meadowbank. Great penalty. Bobby Geddes guessed right but couldn't stop it. And so Tommy Burns, the veteran of so many important occasions in football, had to score this to keep Kilmarnock in. Saved by McQueen. And 4-3 on penalties. Kilmarnock go out. And that's Meadowbank through to a tie against Morton in the next round and uh, Kilmarnock, Derek, were the first victims in the Tenet Scottish Cup of a penalty shootout. So uh, that's a second one for them and unlucky to go out that way, obviously. Well, they are. They knew after this round that they had, someone had to go out again. Uh, Tommy Burns would be one disappointed man, but uh, that's how it goes. And uh, Kilmarnock will be very, very disappointed as well. They're struggling now in the first division. That's them out of the cup. They're going to have to get their sleeves up now. Don't call me Dougie if you could. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> on to other Scottish results now.